You enjoy it? Yeah, very much. Great. Yeah, Eile Harbour, uh, one of the shooting stars 2018, and she made a very, very great job on Thelma. But now you're here as a shooting star, so how humbling is it for you being one of the ten that's been selected? Yeah, I think it's wonderful to be here in Berlin and to be part of uh, the shooting stars. Uh, it's very overwhelming and I'm honored to be a part of such an amazing group of people. And uh, you told before that uh, there's a new uh, coming age in the Norwegian cinema, like the Nordic noir genre. So uh, some words about that. Yeah, I think, it's, I think the development of the film industry in Norway is very interesting. I think it's, um, some films are more commercial and, and more genre based and some are um, more like drama but still captures the, I think both captures still the Nordic feel of the cinema and I think that's something we should keep and, and try to further develop uh, and I think, I don't know exactly what it is but uh, I think it, you know, what makes uh, Scandinavian films unique is the nature definitely and uh, the light is very bright in a way um, and um, maybe our, you know, cultural and heritage with our, our mythical kind of folk tales that inspires us to treat nature in a more like mystical um, way. I don't know. I think it's something that we take with us in our creative work. And um, with uh, Thelma, I, I feel the cinematography also captures that, uh, like, brooding sense, yeah. And it's very cold in Norway, so um, if I see all these pictures where you go into the water in Thelma, um, I don't think this was be a summer shooting time. I think it was autumn or maybe winter, so uh, how, how, how uh, are you um, good to that? So are you some kind of uh, person who, who likes the cold or are you just like me, some kind of person saying, okay, my um, uh, apartment needs 25 degrees Celsius uh, to feel very, very, very comfortable. <laughs> I, yeah, I, I think uh, I enjoy the cold in a way. I'm, I'm not that much into winter sports. I wish I was, but um, I think it's difficult because in Thelma, especially when I had to go into, I had to go into the water, as you mentioned, um, it's very crucial scene for the character, but still I can I could feel my body almost working against that um, intuitive feeling. And, you know, you just start to shake and to st you stiffen and then your body kind of works, your, works against your emotional awareness. And I think that's complicated and that, but that tension also creates a space to, you know, um, express like a, a emotional complexity yeah so I think it's very for me it's very exciting to work with the elements you could say um, a festival like the Berlinale is some kind I think um, of a platform especially for young actors and me maybe meeting new producers meeting new directors maybe maybe getting the next project started so are you maybe have made some contacts until now or did you hope to make some contacts maybe to get your next role here that would be incredible uh, so far I flew in yesterday and we haven't had that much time yet but I know that a part of the schedule is meeting with casting directors for instance and, and producers as you mentioned uh, and I think it's just a wonderful opportunity to hopefully be working internationally as well. Norway is not so far away from Germany, uh, maybe you learned a little bit German in the past so do you know a little bit uh, of the German language? Unfortunately, I don't know German, but it's some words are similar to Norwegian, so I can understand some small words. So yeah. Okay. And um, maybe your expectations for the future? Uh, yes, I I don't know if I can predict the future, but I'm very hopeful. I I really want to continue acting. Thank you so much. Thank you.